Hello everyone, welcome back to Firefighting Simulator The Squad. Today, we're going to get in and continue where we left off uh, a couple weeks ago now at this point. We've uh, it's been a few weeks since we played this, but we're going to jump in where we continued where we left off. And that's going to be with a fire down here in downtown. Now, the office burnout, this is called, and it looks like there's some fire on the second and third floor. So I think this is actually going to be, let's see here. Uh, we're going to go with the T-Rex because we have the ability to get to multiple floors. Yeah, we'll do the T-Rex. Um, it looks like there's going to be... This is going to be the first fire that we actually have tackled. With the fact that uh, there's multiple floors to it. In like an office building or a commercial building. Obviously, we've uh, tackled fires like two-story houses and whatnot. But this seems like it's going to be the first commercial one that we've done that's multiple floors. That's super loud, okay. We're gonna follow this guy. Turn our siren on here. We're not, I mean, we are kinda a good distance away. Oh, that, wow, that fire truck just destroyed him. I guess that's what happens when you turn out in front of them. So we do have a, a little bit of a drive. Wow, he is just hitting everyone today. Maybe I don't want to be behind this guy. <laughs> oh my. So yeah, it's been a, it's been a few weeks since we played this. Um, we got into teardown a little. Uh, and then we just started uh, on Wednesday, PC Building Simulator, which is very fun. I've been having a lot of fun with that. And uh, all that, so I'm excited to get back into this, though. I, I do love this game. As you, I'm ripping, I don't want to be behind that guy anymore. Um, I, I do really like this game and, and the mechanics of it. It's, it's super fun to play even as single player and maybe at one point we'll do multiplayer but we got smoke showing from this building watch out firefighters what am i stuck on oh there's firefighters here in my way bruh you ruined my fast driving time and got me into an accident. I can't move now. Oh, that sucks. You all suck. They weren't expecting me to get in. And, oh god, we got fire all through the first floor. Okay. This looks, uh... Might be going to the second floor there. But definitely into the first floor. All the way. But you think? It's coming out the windows. We're just going to go straight through a primary. I need a pry. And then we're, we're doing this. Okay. Second floor. We're going right to it. Oh, it's already up there. Um, one. I'm just, I'm trying to get ahead of this at this point. I can get him to push down there. While we go up to this third floor and evacuate these guys. Two. Three. There we go. Okay, this room's vacant. I'm gonna carry this one. Let's 
See, it's already pushing the stairs. Power's off. That's good. Okay, third floor primary is clear. We're going to get these guys out. And then we're going to try... Hopefully he's got this push back enough. Or we can do a, a second floor, actually. That vic they're, uh, they're almost done with those victims, so... Okay, primary is good. We could punch holes in these walls if we wanted. Two, this is all you. Three, I want you to stand by with me. Actually, three. Um... No, no, no. You? I want you to grab an axe for me. We're going to go through these walls on our own. Great. Uh, I can do it myself. I didn't think of this the first time. Yeah, I'm working on it. Uh, two. Redirect three, you're taking that. Two. Okay, two's right here. Two's gonna grab that. We're gonna go through on this side now. Uh, one, I need you to come this way. We're going to have to breach this side. Let's see if we can't, uh... We'll let him do some work on there. Oh, boy. Okay, we're going to let, uh, oh boy, this is not good. See if we can't, oh, that's a backdraft waiting to happen. Um, you grab a hose line for me. This is just, it's not good at all so much bad with this. We got fire through three floors. And it is blocking every stairway, every door. Okay, there's no one in here. I gotta, I gotta, I think I'm gonna have to go out the window here. There we go. I'm gonna need that aerial up here. Um. Okay, we're... I'm going out the window. Sorry, bud. I'm going out the window. Maybe. Alright. This place is ready to just explode at any second.
I would never do this on a real save, but you gotta do what you gotta do sometimes, you know? It is what it is, and we just have to do it. Alright. Um. What do I got? Two? Can you come grab him? Who's up here? Is this... I, uh, I don't know anymore. Okay, I know I got a primary on second and three complete. One. Come down here. Two, you're gonna come on the other side. Excuse me, three, and then I'm gonna grab a hose line as well so we can start this. Jeez Louise, this is a disaster. Just a complete disaster of a building fire. Okay, we got a supply line to both of these though, which is good. We got two hose line or two uh, plugs established. We got three hose lines now in operation. You grab a hose line. You're gonna have to establish one, but you're. This is a concern of mine. Uh, we got a backdraft here. And this is not going to be good. So let me kind of clean up some of this real quick. We got to get down this hallway. Let me see if I can't get down this hallway first. Yeah, keep... Hit this hallway. Whoa, flare. We kind of got that contained, so that's good. Um... Two, come back over- or three, come back over there. What are you doing there, bud? Work with us here, would ya? I still don't understand the fast mission time on that. That is ridiculous. We gotta get the oh boy. This is cooking. Did you get that all knocked out? No, oh, come on, buddy. Wow. This is this is a fire if I've ever seen one. Holy I'm gonna try to get into this room here. We gotta do a primary. Holy crap. Problem is these corners, I can't get around these corners enough. There we go. Got a computer on fire over here. Yeah, okay. Beautiful. Beautiful. We're making progress. Kind of. This is a crazy fire right now. Holy. I understand why this is the only mission it gives you at this point in the game. Like, this is a ridiculous fire. This would be a defensive fire all the way. Problem is, we haven't been able to get a primary on the entire first floor. We got them on the other ones. Floors 2, 3, and the roof. Um, but we haven't been able to get a primary on this first floor. 
because of all this this fire. Although it looks like I'm getting a good hold here. Maybe. We'll see. Okay. This is not great. Actually, three, yeah. Why don't you come in here? Thank you. And we'll work on this uh, side by side. Kind of get this roof that's uh, on fire. I don't want it getting behind us at all. one in there. I want to just check uh, yeah, this. Pretty much been able to see the entire area in there. And I understand that there's not a victim in that. So we're going to continue and try to get to this back room here. God, we're going to be here forever. I don't understand how this is a slow mission time. I, I or a, The ability to have a fast mission time is ridiculous. Uh, I just, I don't understand that. It was like nine minutes. How's that coming in there? Okay, all three of you are in there. That's that's great. We're nowhere. We're not making progress on this at all. <laughs> there is very little progress being made. I can just hit one room at a time, though. That's why I put put two of them in there, but really only three of them. All three of them went. Um, if I can make one room at a time. If we can kind of protect those rooms, we can probably get a hold of this pretty good. Yeah, all, all three of y'all. And then, uh, so we got the Alpha Delta corner room out. See, oh my god. Let's get this back here behind us. I don't want this blocking the door on me. This would 100% be a defensive fire if this was real life. 100%. There would be no way that I would go interior on this after the victims have been removed. This is just insane. We're kind of making a hit, though. Pretty good hit on the first floor. Just taking us quite some time. There we go. There we go. I do hear that room behind me just blaring. Someone keeps hawking their horn too, like we're blocking the road. Like you don't see this entire building just on fire. Multiple victims. Like, chill. We don't need your honking too. Kind of made a good attack here. 
on this front room, although that corner is still raging. This was the backdraft room, too. Jeez Louise. It's gonna be the only fire we do this episode. Yeah, yeah, we're almost there. Okay, how are they making on uh, this back room? We still have yet to do primaries. Starting to catch those curtains on fire over there. There we go. Okay, we got a primary on this. We got one more room here, and it looks like they're in it. Turn our flashlight on. Okay, that's good. So they should be upstairs now on the second floor. Get this, uh, this stairwell up back under control. Whoa, a little flare up there, bud. Might be better if we go from the uh, exterior here. I just I need to get through that stairwell. Can't sit on that stairwell anymore. It's not safe. There we go, actually. Have one on this the uh, each room. One on the hallway, and I'll kind of just assist where I need to. Get some of these roof hot spots out. Gotta make sure I'm kinda gonna assume a safety roll here, but also a fire attack roll. Kind of making sure nothing sneaks up behind us and yes, sir. Yes, yeah oh, we're gonna help him this uh this room's almost under control so i'll help him get uh this situated and then i'll actually go through that hole we made in the wall and kind of hit it from the other side. That other guy. Uh, what are you? Why don't you, uh, come over here and assist? And I will go through here. Uh, fine, then why don't you come here? You can assist me. Oh, boy, oh boy. We got a bookshelf over here. This, this building's a complete waste. It's, it's gone. It's a total loss. This is a demolish and rebuild situation. I would I would go get the T-Rex up, but there's just no way that that's going to provide any uh any assistance through this for me. Let's get this we'll get this room under control because this has the less amount of uh fire and we need that other nozzle man at this point. Just 
just insane. We haven't even touched the third floor yet. I'm I'm hesitant to go up there. <laughs> if the first two floors are like this, by the time we get to the third floor, that's going to be just gone. Yeah, yeah, there we go, okay. Getting places. Get this table out. Okay. Now that we have that extra nozzle in. We'll just start working our way down. I'm going to keep pushing this hallway here with this guy. Oh my, yeah, it's all the way up the stairs. Because this is the back side of that room that one guy was in that we were in that we cut the hole. That's where he is, is to our uh, left. So if we can get some of this, we can help him as well. We're making progress. It's it's pushing hard on us, but we're making progress. Let's get this corner kind of knocked out. Holy. This is one of the most realistic fires I've seen on this game so far. I mean, they're all realistic, but this one, oh my. It's quick your, quit your honking. No one cares. Uh, I need, I need one of you over this way. We're going to get this spot. We're going to send him in. I'll be right behind him here. We're going to push this room. Yeah, there we go. Beautiful. Get this. Uh, there's still a lot of fire. I can hear it everywhere. I'm going to check this room. This room actually is never, not even touched. Shows you the, the power of doors because that door was uh, two. Yes, that door was closed. So that's why you shut your doors uh, at night, like your bedroom doors and whatnot. So if there's a fire and you're sleeping, um, the door will, will save you actually. That and smoke alarms, which I, I'm surprised they don't have uh, like fire alarms and smoke alarms and stuff going off in these uh, buildings. Although it would be annoying. It would be super realistic and I'd love it. The ability to shut it off too, that'd be nice. Or even the potential to just like roll up for a smoke alarm call and all of a sudden the entire building's on fire. Um, three, and we'll get this floor knocked out. This is the last room on this floor that's still, uh, still engulfed. Gotta take care of behind us here. There we go. And, oh man.
Got all four of us in here. Get the second floor taken care of. Okay. One more floor and it's raging. I can hear it still. <laughs> what I'm going to do is I'm going to push uh, two of them this way. And then I'm going to take one and we're going to go up the fire escape and push the other way. So hopefully we can uh, get this taken care of. Wow, that is legit raging. Holy crap. It's been 27 minutes just on the second attempt. Trying to get this doorway secured. There we go. Oh boy. Get this stairway uh, secured for them. That way they can continue and get up here and help us. Maybe not. Oh, this is pushing back. Jesus. There we go. He came up. Nice. Um, okay, you can go there then. Two, you can go there. And we'll just... Uh, we'll just keep working on this whole thing. gonna be this is literally the only fire we're gonna do this entire episode so i hope you uh i hope you enjoyed i guess i mean holy crap i was not expecting this to be this bad or this large i should say you have fun with that i'm gonna we're gonna have to hit that from the other side we would have had to switch air bottles by now too probably 30 minutes now we would be just at the point where we would be going for a recycle you always split your bottle into thirds so you got a half hour bottle 10 minutes in 10 minutes of work time 10 minutes out if you got a 45 minute bottle 15 in 15 to work 15 to get out that way in case anything goes wrong you got plenty of time to figure it out at this point we're going to be here for 50 minutes the longest firefighting simulator video ever Who's, uh... Go there. Oh, it's pushing that door again on me. Don't like that. Let's see if we can't... Yeah, oh, maybe not. Need to get this door clear, but that's like impossible at this point.
Problem is, the door looks clear right now, but as soon as I go in, it's not. I'm just, I'm just sending it into the bathroom. Bathroom's my safe space at this point. I'm gonna hold the bathroom. There we go. getting like the fire's just getting hid behind these doors too and that's not that's creating issues for me Let's see if we can't get this chair and desk out Oof. I don't want that sneaking up behind us. Oh, well, thank you. Okay. Should be able to get this, uh, this room pushed back quite a bit now. With two of us working. This would be... I would be very curious to see what started this fire. There could be a lot of cause. I've seen, uh... Numerous computers, so like electrical issue, some spark or something. I've seen, uh, um, like fridges and stuff, and like a little kitchenette here, so, I mean, there could be a cooking-related incident. I'd be very curious to see, though, what's, what actually started this. We're making a good hit on this room now, though. Getting the majority of this fire knocked down here. If you honk one more time, I am going to flip your car over. I don't even know. I don't think there's access from this room to any of the others. I think they're all pretty isolated. Okay. This room's out. Let's go, uh... You stay there. I'm gonna go assist these guys, I think. Oh, boy. Let me... Let me hold. He hasn't even pushed in. We're just gonna, we're gonna, all four of us, work on one room at a time here. Instead of splitting it. Because this is just... We need to get this under control at this point. This is, it's, it, it's out of, it, it's way past out of hand. Just completely way past out of hand. We, and power and numbers at this point. This is that door I was working on too. So, I mean, if all four of us are in there, we're kind of getting... The two rooms, I what I thought were two separate rooms, are one room, so. You know, I, I guess that's a plus, but oh my god. Trying to separate here. See if I can't, like, uh, cut it off. Cut the fuel source off. 
but it doesn't seem to be working as, as good as I'd hoped. This, this is insane. We'll help, uh, help this guy here. That's, that was, see, the door was getting in his way, too. That was his issue. Okay, we'll open this back up. Oh, he's still attacking over there. Okay. Oh, not the dinosaur. No, I have seen a lot of dinosaurs in this building, though. There's, like, one in every single room. There we go. Okay, we're making progress ish. We're getting there. We're getting there. In this room, let me uh, help him with here. The fire gets like behind these curtains. Also, where's the sprinkler system in this building? We talked about f smoke detectors and fire alarms. Where's the, uh, where's the sprinklers? Okay. Yeah, you just start there. I'm going to go assist this guy, see what his needs are. Because then we are pretty much just the stairwell at this point. Uh... Yes, sir. We'll get one more in here. I think three of us will be able to knock this out pretty good. <sighs> Boy. Going on 40 minutes of fighting this fire. That is insane for this game. Usually it's like 10 minutes. Quadrupled that. And we're not even done yet. Like the end's in sight. Yeah, there goes the average mission time too. Oh, wow. That's all right. We're having fun. That's all that matters. Okay. Let's go get this, uh, let's go get this finished here. Should be, uh, the stairwell in this last room. It looks like the stairwell is out. Is there any? Okay. Let me get behind us here. Yeah. I, mean, I figured there was some behind us. Let's get this taken care of first. I don't want this sneaking up behind me, you know? There we go. Get this uh, corner while they're getting that. There we go. We're almost there. Just gonna check, make sure that's good. That is. I do hear some fire cooking though. Down, is it downstairs? Uh 
Uh, looks like it's down, down, way down. Oh, this room. Really? We literally, we, this room was out already. We'll work on this one. Like, there's that little kitchenette there. Or one of them. I've seen a couple of them. They do have emergency lighting in, though, which is... Is that an arcade machine? That is. getting there. Hopefully this is it and we didn't miss another thing. We're lucky this actually didn't spread. Yeah, we're lucky this really didn't push out into that hallway. Because that would have, it would have just lit the entire first floor back on fire. Okay. Okay. We're getting places. Yeah, we're getting there. We're almost there. Come on, we got this, guys. Oh, I hear more. It's definitely this back room here. Okay, it's just some curtains. I can live with curtains. <laughs> wow, 44 minutes. That's insane. Holy crap. Wow. That's, uh... The longest firefighting simulator mission ever. I could have got that um, T-Rex out, but honestly, with the amount of rooms and, and all that in there, there was no way. We got an achievement, though. T-Rex driver, medium uh, driving time. Obviously, the slow mission time. Uh, we got two unlocked. We got the Rosenbauer Command Walk-In Rescue. Ooh, that sounds uh, nice. Rescued five victims. Five. That's insane. But we did it, so... Ooh, running up that hill. Ooh, we're gonna have to stay tuned for that. Hmm. Anywho, uh, yeah, that's where we're gonna call it for this, uh, for this episode. Uh, thank you all for tuning in to Firefighting Simulator, the squad. I appreciate it. I apologize for the long episode. I did not expect to A, fail that the first time, and B, have that much of an insane fire. But it was tons of fun, and uh, I hope you come back because this looks like a really, really uh, interesting mission. So thank you all for tuning in, and we'll uh, see you on the next episode.